Recovery schools have helped me 100%, completely done a 180 in my life. ABCD William J. Osaga High School is a recovery high school for young people who are in recovery from substance abuse. The event with the Office of the National Drug Control Policy was quite an honor for Gil Kurlikowski, uh, the director of the Office of National Drug Control Policy, to come back to the school. He's been here before, and this time bring his colleagues from Russia to come and visit our school uh, and be able to learn, to see what we're doing with our students, what we're doing to support young people in recovery, to see our challenges and to see the progress we've made in that area. Путем погружения молодых людей, оказавшись в трудной жизненной ситуации, в процесс освобождения от зависимости, восстановления что ли их в социуме, по сути, ресоциализации молодых людей и подготовки их для новой жизни. We really what I'm most proud of is the community that we've created for young people and their families, giving them support as they go through this journey in recovery. What I love the most is that they're they're really partners with the parents that we're all kind of on the same page as far as keeping our children clean and sober and, and realizing that whatever actions the kids take, there are consequences. I think one of the delegates from Russia said it. Um, she was impressed by how mature the panel was. A lot of people are drinking in high schools and uh, when you're still newly sober, it's like being a child again. And everything is going to influence you to a certain extent. It gave me more than just recovery. It gave me the opportunity to have a life after recovery. Ostagai cultivates recovery, whereas if I was in my old school, it would have been very easy to get away from, uh, from doing the right thing. These are kids, and, 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 and they really, um, may, if not figured it out, are, are leaps and bounds ahead of some of their peers. Before, I would just lie to people, manipulate them, and I don't have to do that anymore. The message we wanted to send in general about recovery is that first of all addiction is not a moral character or a flaw or a weakness. Addiction, it does not discriminate. It crosses all lines and all cultures. So it's really wonderful to have a global interest in doing something about recovery and addiction.